So everybody has different needs. You know, some people who are using Premiere Pro, mm -hmm. uh, you know, they're going to be very content with something, say, like a Quadro 4000. Uh, and so the question is, do you need, you know, how complex do you want to work? Do you want to work with lots and lots of multicam? Uh, in those cases, then somebody, you know, they may want to go to a Quadro 5000. They may want to go straight to a Maximus system and maybe start with a Quadro 2000 and a Tesla C2075. Uh, and then, you know, if somebody's doing a lot of motion graphics work, utilizing the new optics, it's, it's tricky because everybody's use case is different. You know, you edit different than I edit, and I edit different than somebody else. I mean, in, in the best sense, you know, more is always better, okay? Not only now, but it gives you room to grow. And it gives you room to do different, you know, different options. Uh, maybe today you're doing Premiere Pro editing only, but maybe you want to add, you're going to do 3D graphics in uh, After Effects. You want more GPU. And so, so no way to there's no way to say this guy needs, you need this, and you need this. And we've, we've tried very hard to figure out uh, what everybody needs. And the information, especially you come to a show like NAB, and everybody's different. One, you know, red footage. Somebody's doing one thing with red. Even red's not all the same because some guys shooting all in red, but all they want to do is output 1080p. And some guys want to shoot in, uh, you know, with a scarlet and do everything in 5K. Uh, and it's so it, it's very difficult to, to get one, make one size fit everything. Uh, but the best, I and mean, that's the best thing about a Maximus configuration, is that it's flexible. You're not locked into one Quadro, one Tesla. You can have a 2000 and a C2075. You can have a 6000 and a 2075. You can have a 6000 and four, you know, T75s. If the application is designed to support multi-GPU and really take advantage of it. Uh, and more and more applications are. Applications like the Cinefilm uh, stuff for doing uh, noise removal. So, you know, faster, faster, better, more GPU. Uh, but uh, it, it really depends on individual use case. So the limitation just, now it's just motherboard maybe. How many slots you, you can use? Is, motherboard does, is something that you need to consider. Uh, you know, how many 16x PCIe slots can you get? Uh, and you know, the nice thing is that uh, manufacturers are adding, are realizing that they need to add more. And so they are, uh, you know, we've got, you know, we're showing a system in here from Supermicro with, uh, you know, I think it's got four by 16 slots on it. Uh, you know, that's nice to have. <laughs>